The Stanford Cardinal head coach is Tara Vanderveer. She's assistant. It's been uh, an unbelievable experience to be able to be a part of a program that started out with. Um, not that many wins um, and coming in and turning around the program and knowing that we were playing not just for us but knowing that we had the support of our alumni of our school of our program of our staff of um, the president like it just showed that we were playing for something bigger than us and um, that's what coach constantly reminded us and that's why we work so hard because we don't play for ourselves, we play for the name on our jersey, we play for the person next to us, we play for everyone who's a part of this program. So it's just been an unbelievable experience to be able to take this program to the next level and excited to um, see what else it's able to do after this. always emphasizes that we need to play our game. We're not worried about um, what the other team is doing. We're focused on what we're doing. And I think in the first half when we were down, we hadn't scored. It was like we got our jitters out. It was like, okay, well, and then we started playing and we were like, oh, like when we play our game, good things happen. So I think it just shows um, who we are as people and as a team and as a program is that um, you continue to fight. So, and that's what we did and we started to show it. So. <laughs> Sixteen and two run because that's what we do. It didn't matter that we were playing against Stanford. It was matter that we were executing and putting the ball in the basket. It wasn't we went into the halftime and oh we're up one at the half. No, that's 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 not who these kids are. These kids are kids who show up and grind every single day and do what they're supposed to do. <laughs> had individual lapses on defense, but when we came together and we were all working together on defense, that's when our defense showed that it did well. So it wasn't just one person doing well defensively, it was when everybody would rotate, when everybody would talk, when everybody would have ball pressure. So um, I think no matter what, it's a, it's a team effort on both sides of the court. except in the fact that, that we played anywhere close to decent defensively when they shot 51% from the field and 59% in the second half. And so, uh, like our kids said, and we talked about in the locker room afterwards, and when you play against a team like Stanford um, at this level, uh, when you have breakdowns, they will make you pay. So, you know, Bob Knight always said, that, you know, the, the team that we, makes the fewest mistakes is going to win. And I thought they were much more solid than we were in the second half, um, especially on the defensive end.
they don't fear anyone. It's just the way these kids were made before we ever got them. We've been fortunate enough to develop them. But we aren't we aren't the, the we aren't the little engine who could. They shed that a while ago. If you go back and look what these kids have accomplished from beating UCLA, UCLA as sophomores to what they did in the tournament last year against the South Carolina team that nobody gave them a shot, we're not the little engine who could.